what is apple cider vinegar is it good for your skin or should you try it i don't know let's see and find out so just keep watching Apple cider vinegar is a fermented version of an apple juice, so it contains mainly acetic acid, citric acid, malic acid, and even lactic acid in a small quantity. So what is the pH of this apple cider vinegar? The pH is around 2 to 3, like even lemon is around 2, so both these products, they are very acidic to your skin. And the pH of our skin is around 4.5 to 5.5. As you know, uh, like previously, I've already told the importance of pH in your skin barrier function. Concentrated acetic acid is also used in, uh, in, as an OPD procedure as a chemical peel. So these are like, of course, they are natural and all, but they are also chemicals. And you never know, like if you dilute yourself, you never know what is the percentage of acetic acid, which is the main ingredient. So you never know what is the concentration and is it stable or anything. First is it is an exfoliant. So this is a chemical exfoliant. I, as I told, it is a chemical which is used for chemical peels also. So it will exfoliate your skin, remove your dead skin cells, and for example, if you have pigmentation, hyperpigmentation and all, it will be helpful in that. But uh, just wait, I, I don't recommend this apple cider vinegar on your face. The second one is, it is an antibacterial. Bacteria causing acne, which is propionibacterium acne. So they say it can kill the bacteria. There are so many people who say that... Um, apple cider vinegar has helped in their acne since it goes exfoliation if you have any ingrown hair it is supposed to be beneficial for ingrown hair so so it helps in pigmentation acne ingrown hair it helps uh, like the make the skin glowy that's what they claim so what are the side effects of this apple cider vinegar if you apply it and dilute it you are going to burn your skin as I told, it is very acidic and for sensitive skin, for any skin type, it is going to burn your skin. It will make it red, irritate, like itchy. It will cause burning sensation. So the main side effects will be irritant contact dermatitis. As we know, the pH of our skin is very important to maintain the skin barrier. Like the skin is protecting us from the external environment. So if you damage this skin barrier, if you damage the balance, it is not good for your skin. It may cause infection, breakouts, irritation, dryness, and everything. So girl, don't apply that acidic things on your face. Please don't try to treat any skin conditions on your own. Many dermatologists do not recommend apple cider vinegar on your face. So it is very important because it is a good source of irritation. And you may be using so many skincare products which could aggravate all this like whatever you have splattered on your face why should you try apple cider vinegar on your face when there is a safer and alternative uses like for example if you are trying to treat acne so uh for from my side it's better if you avoid it would be like a no no so if you still want to use apple cider vinegar in your skincare apart from all the side effects and the uh, irritation possibilities so these are the few tips which you have to know before using apple cider vinegar like first of all you should never apply directly on your face many people they dilute like one is to three three will be the water whenever you apply on your face you should not leave on as a toner or something you should apply it leave uh, leave it on for maybe around 20 seconds 30 seconds or something and wash it off so uh, like even chemical peel there's a short contact time use this as a natural exfoliant chemical exfoliant after you use apple cider vinegar you should not use again a chemical exfoliant or a physical exfoliation but if you're going to use it these are the ways you can use it a, a little bit safer but I do not recommend 
let me just make myself clear I do not recommend I will not use it because my cheeks are already red and I'm using vitamin C sometimes I use glycolic acid face wash so I don't oh, oh, the smell the smell of apple cider vinegar is so bad oh my god I'm not going to use I have asked the questions in, like in Instagram whether apple cider vinegar like have you tried or is it helpful for your skincare and 38% said yes and 68% said no for majority of the people it is a no no and I'm on that side I'm on the no side some said no not for sensitive skin I completely agree and uh, she said she mixed apple cider vinegar with 1 is to 3 ratio and makes the skin very glowy. Like if you don't have sensitive skin or anything, you can give it a try with diluted apple cider vinegar. But uh, for sensitive skin, uh, just, just don't keep your hands on them. I have tried it on my scalp. They said apple cider vinegar is good for your scalp. It nourishes. It has to be diluted like in a big mug. You have to dilute and after shampooing, I'm just telling you, I'm not doing all this. After shampooing your hair, you can just pour it once, like, and leave it for maybe one or two minutes and just rinse it off. I tried it for losing weight and it doesn't work. See, trying to lose weight is not a simple thing, like you drink apple cider vinegar in the morning and you're like, mm. no, nothing will happen like that. Like to lose weight, you have to work out, you have to do weight training proper diet high protein diet there are so many things uh, maybe i will share my thoughts on this i don't know i'm not a professional but <laughs> see now i'm fat but previously girl i was 60 and i was strong and some people say they don't really uh, see any difference after they apply i don't know how to use it's not like it's a magical solution so you don't have to try. I use apple cider vinegar for suntan, but as I said, I'm not going to try. The smell is so bad, I'm not going to even give it a try. Uh, she used to drink with lemon, with lemon juice. Like, see, these two solutions, they are very, uh, they are very acidic. It destroys the enamel. <laughs> That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe and press the bell button so that um, you get notification. Oh my god, my neighbor. Share it with your friends and, and press the bell.